Now in this question then we've got x equals tan y and we've got to show that dy dx equals 1 over 1 plus x squared. So how are we going to do this? Well, it's very easy to think that you've got to find dy dx straight away but you'll notice that you've got simply x here in terms of y. So what I would suggest you do is instead of differentiating this with respect to x you actually differentiate it with respect to y. So I'm going to say differentiate with respect to y. And if you do that, you're therefore going to have the differential of x with respect to y is going to be dx by dy. Now when it comes to differentiating tan y with respect to y, you should know that the differential of tan of an angle is sec squared of that angle. So this would be sec squared y. Now what is sec squared y? There's an identity for sec squared y. Again, you should know that this identity that 1 plus tan squared of any angle, let's say theta, is identical to sec squared of that angle. And it's that that we use here. That angle that we're using is not theta, but y. So we've got 1 plus tan squared y. Now we know what, uh, what um, tan y is. Tan y is x. So we can write this as 1 plus x squared. So what we've got then is that dy, dx by dy is equal to 1 plus x squared. And obviously this is looking very similar to this. Well, you can imagine that this is over 1. So what we can do is essentially turn this upside down. We can say that therefore dy by dx is equal to 1 all divided by 1 plus x squared. And there you go. dy dx 1 over 1 plus x squared. So I hope you've been able to follow that.